Hey guys! This video is about clipping your guinea pig's nails. I trim my guinea pig's nails every 4 to 8 weeks depending on how long they are. Long nails can get uncomfortable for them so it's important to give them a trim every now and then. But in this video I'm going to show you how I trim the nails when I'm on my own. You're going to need a fleece blanket or cozy on a table and some nail clippers. I use these, others rather use real clippers. It really depends on what works best for you or what you're more comfortable with. Then I take Sylvester's front foot with one hand, keep him close to my body so that he can't run away and trim the nails with my other hand. If you look closely at your guinea pig's nails, which is easiest if they have white nails, you can see a red line. So part of the nail is white and then at the red line the nail starts looking more red-ish. And this is called the quick. It's a blood vessel and ideally you don't cut into it. If you do, it's going to bleed and your guinea pig will feel a bit of pain for a few seconds. It's not the end of the world because the bleeding usually stops pretty fast and your piggy will have forgotten about it in a few hours. But it's uncomfortable, so if you're unsure, trim less rather than more. For the back foot, I'm just going to hold him close to me and then lift his foot to trim it. Sylvester is quite relaxed. Pebbles, on the other hand, always tries to escape and turns nail clipping into a huge deal. So I hold her tightly against me for clipping her front nails and I also try to hold her paw in place. For her back feet, I usually lift her up because she then doesn't struggle as much. I find this method easier for nervous piggies who try to pull away. Some of Pebbles nails are black, which makes it difficult to see the quick. If you're really unsure or if your piggy's nails are black, you can put a flashlight under your piggy's nail. Just make sure you don't hurt their eyes. And if you look carefully, you should be able to see a line which tells you where the quick is. It takes a bit of practice until you have figured out how your piggies are going to react and which methods work best for them. I hope you found this video helpful and see you guys next time!